hello youtube what's up so on to this video we will talk about uh, to submit a form to download a uh, pdf you need to submit a form and you will get that pdf on your email so we have seen this on many website those people like to show their uh, case studies white papers on their websites so they can collect the user data so for that purpose so collecting the user data or targeting the particular users we need those kind of features so let's see how we can do that so for that i need plugins i'm using the elementor plugin for website builder as i will so for that contact form first i need that contact form 7 so i'm installing that one okay now i have the contact form and i need a page so let's add new page and uh, download pdf by this form so this is my page name So I have make a page and now I'm going to use Elementor. <clears throat> okay, we have install the contact form 7 so here you can see the contact form so let's open this dismiss now i'm using this simple form so let's edit this one <clears throat> so if you are new on the contact form 7 that is fine and uh, i will explain this one so we will be we are building something like uh, there is one page and user will see the uh, case studies that uh, that were company that uh, case study built and uh, case studies suppose we have case studies like uh, erp software so we uh, so we can add that case study we will add some details that uh, we have done this one this is the solution and that's it if you want to see more you need to download the case studies so customer will enter their name and email after submit button they will they will get a message your case studies have sent on your email so they will de definitely put their original email so i don't need the subject one so i'm removing this one also message part i don't need one okay. and submit i'm just so we need only uh, your name and email and let's save this one So this is a link we need to put this on our page so I'm on our page so I'm just getting one block page uh, any page like agency or landing page restaurant travel blog 
anything so this one is a free let me insert so this page is inserted here we don't do need this one so I'm just need this and I don't need this also I just need this part only so I don't need this one this one this one this one I'm just deleting delete delete okay now it's done so suppose this one is our case studies so what I will do I will make a duplicate uh, suppose this is our case study let me make case study one uh, regarding ERP software okay and here we can add any te text related to this case studies so I'm adding and this one and on next text I will add like uh, to read more more download the case study case study by filling in a form okay so I have added this text I can just uh, we can edit like this is just the basic I'm giving you it's not actual design so I just need little bigger text and uh, it should be like 600 so people will see this one I can change the color so it should be attractive I, yeah, this one is more catchy now and I can make weight transform style yeah now people see that you need to download this one and duplicate now I will fill uh, this link let copy and just delete this one put here and just update this one now we have like to download to read more download the below case study by fill, uh, fill, filling this form so I want you to uh, I want that uh, the customer if one customer want to download this case study he will receive one mail and uh, like that so this part is done now this is working and next we will add messages email
additional mail template option to auto responder so we're using the auto responder so this is how it work the user will fill this one and this submission mail will auto respond so we will put auto respond mail over there so whatever the username it will automate automatically respond to the user that uh, uh, thank you for submitting form like this blah 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 we can auto respond this mail so under this message we will add the URL we can use HTML template if we want use HTML content we can build a stunning like stunning one so you you have seen sales mails like uh, uh, like image wallpapers everything and blogs article like that so we can send like that uh, as well so suppose I have PDF file let me check uh, uh, case studies sample <coughs> suppose this one is my case studies and what I will do I will make a screenshot of this one and upload this file on my case study suppose this one is my case study and this content I want to share uh, to the my user to download this one so what I will do I will just uh, making a file just uh, image I will save this one download okay let's name this one C CS123 now this is my file that I want to share with my customer and for that I need to upload on my media or if you already added your case studies or anything so you can share like that so suppose this one is my case study this image my case study and you can see the URL that URL you need to share with your customer so here we are under autoresponder you need to just go to the mail and if you have HTML content you can use HTML otherwise you can just put your link case study uh, link so this link auto auto respond to the user email now I have to save this one Okay, let's check this one if it's working or not. Your mail. They are putting lots of it. So So I will just uh, fill this one like uh, anything. So I have 
I get these details and I need to submit this one so message has been sent and now the auto respond will message me this details just wait check this is putting so many ads see I got the mail uh, it's showing spam okay so I got the mail to download the case studies so this is my case study I got the mail so hope you guys understand this one so all all we need to do is whatever our URL we need to put under the autoresponder just enable this one and use mail to autoresponder just if you have html content you just enable this one and this will work uh, you can see the image it's working perfectly and just you can put pdf anything and also using html you can put button on the mail fancy buttons like that this is how it works hope you enjoyed the video and if any question you can put on your comment on comment i will definitely reply on thank you